Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. I am so excited for today's video. If you can tell by the title, I have a Primark haul. I have waited ages to be able to say I have a Primark haul. So if you're in the UK, you know that because of COVID and lockdown, Primark has been closed for about three months and we've not been able to shop or see Primark hauls or anything like that. And I think it was last week or the week before, all um, non-essential shops have reopened. So that means Primark reopened. So I got to go. So I did wait about a week to make sure like it was all calmed down and it was absolutely fine. We didn't have to queue to get in at all. There was a queuing system in place for the two meter markers, but we didn't have to queue. Um, as soon as you walked into stores, all the baskets were sanitized, hand sanitizer stations at the entrance and exits. There's a one way in and one way out. There's two meter markers all over the floor. The tills have uh, like big screens up so you don't go near. It's like really well thought out and laid out. So if you're worried, I wouldn't be. It's like such an easy experience and it's actually easier to shop now because it's not like loads and loads of people in there. So yeah, I have not one but two Primark bags. So we'll just get straight onto it. So the first thing I bought, I absolutely love and it is these little shorts these were an absolute bargain for what they were they were only eight pounds so they're a really thick material i'm not sure what you'd call this they've got little turn ups this gorgeous belt um, with the one button there's no zip or other buttons it's just the one button they're elasticated as well and then they've got a gorgeous paper bag waist and i've tried these on and they fit absolutely perfect they're so nice so i picked these up in this color they call it stone they also had them in khaki i'm not sure if they do any other colors but i would like to go and get myself some more of these because i absolutely love those and for eight pounds you can't really go wrong so the second thing i picked up was this dress it's quite hard to show on here so it's this gorgeous muted peachy color and it's got navy spots in some lights they can look black and then it's quite long and it's just got this little drop frill bit here. Um, this comes down to about my knees. So yeah, it does button all the way up, but I don't like the look of it buttoned all the way up. So I've been kind of, when I tried it on, I wore it with the buttons open. I think it's a lot more flattering. It's just got these little sleeves. This one was 13 pounds. Next thing I picked up is just a little basic. It's just this black little bodysuit. So it's a, uh, ribbed material it's really stretchy it's got a nice little v-neck these were only four pounds so an absolute bargain for that i live in bodysuits at the minute i wear them with my jeans when it's a bit cooler or shorts like the ones i've just shown so yeah i wanted to pick up a few more so i've just got this one in black they did have it in other colors as well but i just went for the black and i did size down i'm usually a medium and i went for a small which is a 10 to 12 because they do look quite generous and then i picked up this bodysuit it's a different kind of cut and material so this is more of like a racer back material so it's like this on the front and this is the back it's got these super stretchy thin little spaghetti straps and it's ribs as well and this one is much stretchier than the other one i just really like the cut of this one i went for as you can see the khaki color but i did have this in loads of colors as well I also went for a small in this one because it has got a lot of give to it and this one was £5. So the next item I picked up, I wanted it before the whole lockdown situation happened and I didn't get it and I regret not getting it. So it's one of the first things I looked for when I went in and it is this cardigan. It's a super long length cardigan and it has little splits in the side. It's a really soft rib material. It's in this gorgeous sandy beige colour. They had this in black as well, which I might go back and get because I think, because I think it's such an easy cardigan to wear and I think it will go with everything. It's not super thick, so it's like perfect for like cold summer evenings or the weather we're having now where it doesn't know what it's doing. Um, this one was £10 and I got it in a medium, which is a 12 to 14. And I really like the fit of it. It does fit like a little bit baggy around the armpits. But yeah, I don't mind that. And I just think it's a really nice little staple cardigan to have in your wardrobe. The next thing I picked up, I'm not 100% sure if I'm going to keep. Um, I like the colour and the print of it, but I'm just not sure of the shape of it. So it's this little play suit. And I thought this would be perfect for like when it's 
really warm or just to wear in the garden because it's quite a loose thin material so it's loose like flowy it's quite straight it has got the little tie bit for the back but I think even still with that done up it's not that flattering you have to let me know down below what you think about it it was only seven pound they had this in loads of different prints um like i said i might just keep it from the garden or like in the house when it's really warm i did get it in a 12 maybe if i size down like with the dress um it might look better but yeah it's just this kind of creamy color and it's got these beige and really thin gray black stripes on it it's got buttons down the front and like i said the little tie at the bottom but yeah let me know what you think about this one next thing i picked up was just a basic pair of black cycling shorts i don't own any of these i wanted to get some just to wear with some like oversized t-shirts or jumpers and these are only two pound fifty in primark so you can't get, really go wrong so yeah just a basic pair of black cycling shorts and they also had these in white and gray but i just went for black so I went into Primark looking for shorts. I own about two pairs of shorts. I have about four pairs of denim shorts, but when it's really, really hot and we're indoors and just in the garden, I don't really want to wear denim. It's not really like a forgiving, comfortable material to wear. I just want to put on some like baggy, normal shorts. So yeah, I went looking for shorts and I found these, which were kind of perfect for what I was looking for. They've been, they're really creased where they've been in the bag. But yeah, they are just a basic little flippy short with this elasticated kind of paper bag style waist and they have little pockets also. They are quite see-through, but for what I want them for, they'll be absolutely fine for like sitting around the house or in the garden. And these are only £4, so you can't go wrong for that price. These would be perfect for holidays if anyone's going to get on holiday. But that's the sort of thing I was thinking. They did these in so many colours. I just went for this kind of basic beigey tan colour. They had them in a really nice blue colour. I think they had khaki, black. They had a few with, I think a black with some white polka dots on. But yeah, absolutely loads. So if you're looking out for some basic little comfy shorts that look like a little bit more dressy, then yeah, definitely get down to Primark and pick these up for only £4. So it wouldn't be a Primark haul if you didn't include some pyjamas. And I only picked up one thing, which is really stupid because I actually need some of pyjamas. I don't know why I only got these, but they're just these basic little white shorts. They are only £3. They're the ones that come on the table. You know, they've got loads and loads of little vests and the shorts. So they do these in loads of different designs and colours. But yeah, I went for this material with the little frill on the bottom. They are super, super elasticated, perfect for bed. You don't want your pyjamas tight and digging in. And they've got this little tight waist. These are super see-through, but they're just for bed, so they'll be absolutely fine. Um, yeah, and I thought they were really cute, just wearing them with a plain little vest. And like I said, £3, so I need to go back and pick up some more summer pyjamas so I'm not just left with one or two pairs. Next thing's a little bit boring, not sure if you're actually gonna want to see them, but I just picked up a two pack of pillowcases. These are an absolute steal, they are £1.70. They're just to go on my under pillows, underneath my main ones. Um, this is one of the reasons I've missed Primark, like for basic little things like this. So £1.70 for two pillowcases, if you were to get them anywhere else, they'll be like rip off money and I'm not paying more when I know I can get them this cheap. So yeah, £1.70 for two pillowcases, an absolute bargain. Next thing I picked up was just a little nail varnish. I really like these ones. These are the PS Gel Effect nail varnishes and they're only £1. I have a few of them. I've been wearing this colour quite a lot and I went to get some else which is a little bit brighter than this but not too different. Um, just a bit brighter for the summer but nothing too out there so yeah I just went for this one it's called blush and I really like the colour and for one pound you can't go wrong and then the last thing I picked up for myself were some sunglasses now I've had no sunglasses through all of lockdown I thought I had some but I didn't like I can't find them anywhere so I did have some, but I think Elsie broke them just in like February before this whole lockdown situation happened. And it's one of them things you think, oh, I'll just grab some next time I, I'm out. And 
we didn't get to go out so i've had no sunglasses and i like to try sunglasses on to make sure they suit me because a lot of them don't suit me um so yeah i couldn't order them online so when primark opened that's why the first thing i looked for and i just picked up these sunglasses they're just a basic black frame and they've got a bit of a cat eye and they're only two pound that's another thing about buying sunglasses online like you know you can get them in primark for two pound so i didn't want to spend more than that and if they get broken because i have elsie and she's probably going to end up snapping them then i can go back and get more because they are so cheap so we did also pick up a few bits for the girls they got gift cards for christmas or family members so they have spent them they just got some basic things like cycling shorts little um sweatshirt shorts just comfy things for around the house and garden in lockdown and i picked only one thing up for elsie i wasn't really feeling the baby toddler range but i found this cute little denim shirt now it's a really really soft denim if you know me i do not put elsie in any cut type of denim or jean it has to be kind of this kind of fake soft kind of jean material i just don't think babies should wear it my own opinion if that's what you want to do you go for it but yeah i just want her to be super comfy so i picked up this i thought it was absolutely gorgeous kind of flares out in the middle it's got these cute little buttons down the front which actually are little poppers so super easy for getting babies dressed she's at that age now she's nearly two where it's a struggle and an effort to do anything with her even getting dressed so i need things that are quite simple I like the little detail on the um, shoulder and this was only two pounds in the sale down from five pounds i got this in 18 to 24 months so it's like more for autumn winter she like i said is nearly two but she's absolutely tiny so this would definitely fit her around that time and i like loved it for two pounds so that was everything I picked up. I did think I was going to end up spending so much more money where we haven't been there for months, but there wasn't loads that caught my eye. There wasn't a lot of new things. I think I've read that they said they're not putting out a load of summer stock now. They're just going to like carry on as if they've been open the whole time, like stock the same. So yeah, that's everything I picked up. I might return some of the bits, like the play suit and the dress. Um, I'm going to have to have a little think about that. I'll probably be back to prime up because once it's open it's going to be hard to stay away so if i do go back i will probably have another haul for you so if you like primark hauls and you are not subscribed then please think about subscribing it's totally free just click on the little red subscribe button and then you'll be able to follow my channel don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it and i'll see you all in my next video